The shirts are from Supima Cotton, a, uh, a locally run uh, partnership between cotton growers um, around the world. So um, Mark Lukowitz, the executive vice president of Supima Cotton, donated these high quality, I, you can't feel how good the, the cotton is, but it feels very good. Excellent. Um, they're all collared shirts and we're giving them away to every one of the Startup Weekend Phoenix attendees. Uh, screen printing done by Think Pro here in Tempe. A lot of great partnerships uh, involved in making these. Got all of our sponsors in back. And uh, all in all, it turned out great. Uh, great shirts. And I think we're going to have a lot of happy people getting the best swag shirts you've ever had. I was pretty impressed when I felt it. Yeah. You're making everyone on YouTube jealous. I know. I was going to put about three four of them on, but it's not that. Well, I have a out. couple extras. But all right, Brian, you're one of the uh, organizers here, so yep. there's a lot of behind each and every startup, but there's, in this essence, enough, uh, I guess, the startup just to bring in the sponsors and everything into this. So how, what the, what's the work behind securing some of the sponsors and your hands-on experience of making sure this weekend has happened? Right. I would say the most important thing that helped us get sponsors was the fact that it was a national event that has been happening you know, in various other cities, so it has a reputation, um, and we had... Uh, we knew that we'd be able to pull, hopefully, up to 100 people um, to this event. And they're tech-savvy people, they're people with, you know, expendable income, great for sponsorships. So we're lucked out that we had a reputable event and a, a good demographic to shoot for. Um, so in, in, in reality, we were able to pull together these sponsorships. So I think we started planning it uh, less than eight weeks ago, or maybe about eight weeks ago, we confirmed, like, okay, let's do it. We had a few options of dates, we chose the quickest one, and it just came together. Yeah, it looks like you've had about 100 people, right? Uh, I think we had it at most, at one time, we had about 80 people. Okay, that's awesome. Yeah, so we, we actually had a great turnout the second day, normally there's a drop-off. We have, I would say, about 65, we did a head count early in the morning, but uh, about 65 people out of those 80 uh, that came back for the second day. Excellent, and Jeremy, the other man behind the mirror, the uh, curtain. That's the mirror. <laughs> the great odds, yes. So tell me about uh, Startup Weekend, the behind it, and you coming out here, and the story. Uh, Startup Weekend, the story. Uh, Andrew had run them for a while, and I've tried to facilitate the ones that I can. Uh, I've always had an excellent uh, experience at them. Phoenix has been no different. Uh, Gangplank's hospitality has been great. Uh, the Phoenix tech community has impressed me, much as uh, a lot of the other ones do. And. I'm really excited to see what people have been able to come up with when they present on Sunday. Excellent.